Hi and welcome to Add More Zest. My name's Rebecca, also known as 4Kids147, and I have a purple box. Any guesses where this one is from? Um, it's turned upside down because of course it has my address on the other side. But Diamond Art Studio have very recently, um, probably been a few weeks by the time this video comes out, but have very recently got some new accessories. And if anybody remembers, they have in the past, oh, and if I can get them off the hook, been kind enough to send me the likes of the AB diamonds that they do in multiple different colours. I just pop them on a book ring to keep them all, all together. But they have a new selection. Are you ready? You might need your sunglasses on. Um, in fact, let's... Let's take them out of the box. I just had to show you the purple. Very big fans of purple. But yeah, this is their new and very, very bright neon drills. Look at these. I need to find the right diamond painting to replace some of these. Um, so there is the 5200, which are glow in the dark. Um, there is a round set and a square set. So they were kind enough to send me both. But we have the B5200 glow in the dark. And then we have neon blue. Look at that. Neon green. That is bright neon purple these are sort of slightly translucent i have done some de-kittings that have had the odd diamond similar to this then we have neon pink and wowzers neon yellow how funky are those now the neon ones will glow in the dark slightly they're not as strong as um, the white actual glow in the dark ones but these will give a glow now Sam did tell me they like um, daylight to sort of charge now all I have in here is studio lights and she's all they've also sent me them in round as well which is absolutely amazing I've got no idea how much they're going to glow in the dark. You've seen they were in a box. I have put them, they look so pretty. Um, I have put them, of course, under my filming lights, which aren't daylight. But let's turn off the lights and see how much they may have charged in what? three minutes let's see oh they've still charged pretty well the glow in the dark are definitely giving more of a light um, I know my camera will adjust ever so slightly but in the actual daylight these two so I think that's the yellow and the pink are showing the most but the others are still showing pretty well. Okay, I'm gonna turn the light back on. Whew. So they're in sort of my eyesight to the diamonds, because it's very hard sometimes. The camera will auto adjust to some things. And of course, they've not had chance to charge in the light. They've definitely not had daylight to charge, not since I've had them anyway. Um, they've only had my big filming lights, which I must admit, give off a lot of light and can get very bright sometimes. But the yellow and the pink seem to definitely shine the most. And then it actually probably went down in those colours. But you will have at least seen the neon ones. They went really, really well. So if you want a pop 
a very, very bright pop of colour, then do treat yourself to these diamonds because I keep trying to think now of what paintings I've got that I might be able to switch some out on and potentially put in that little pop of colour um, for a little bit of an extra pizzazz um, in, in diamond paintings that I'm yet to do. But they're amazing. They are amazing colours and they are pretty, pretty funky. So yeah, thank you so much to um, Sam and Giles for sending me these. Um, I'm going to have great fun with them, hopefully before Megan gets a mitts on any, but we'll see. Um, because her eyes have been shining ever since she knew they were coming. Um, yeah, I'll pop a link to them down below, of course. There is also a discount code there. So if you do want to treat yourself to a bit of a bit of brightness in this winter time, then don't forget to use the code as well. But thank you all so much for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon.